Don Fair is always going to be associated with a couple of things, the strike of 1994 and steroids. Can I give you a precise date? No. Do I expect to know within the reasonably near future um, whether that'll be done? Yes. I'm responsible only to the players, and I'm not responsible. That's who my constituency is, and that's what my practical and legal obligation is. Whatever the issue with steroids is now, um, none of the disclosures or relevations that people have spent a lot of time on have to do with anything that happened currently. It all happened six, seven, eight years ago or more. I think that ultimately he helped grow baseball from a multi-million dollar business to a multi-billion dollar business. That multi-billion dollar business is facing some of the effects of a down economy. While the Phillies have a record payroll and have averaged over 42,000 fans per game, 14 of the 30 major league teams cut their 2009 payroll. Baseball is on pace for the largest year-to-year -year decline in attendance since the 1994 strike. But those around the game are confident baseball will weather the economic storm. Traditionally, baseball, Major League Baseball has been very resistant to recessions, but this is unlike anything we've seen since the 1930s. So we're going to have to wait and see how the trend develops. I'm reasonably optimistic we're going to be able to, to weather this with a minimum of difficulty. The early indications are that baseball is going to suffer some type of revenue decline. Some of the Rust Belt cities, Detroit, Cleveland in particular, are already taking a hit. Not surprising, disposable income is not high in those places and people are being more careful perhaps than they would have been with their money in the past. But in other places, LA comes to mind and certainly Philadelphia, there doesn't seem to be much of an impact yet with the economy. As for Philly, I expect that the World Series swoon will continue all through the season. Sports in general have been, quote, recession proof, unquote, up until now. This is a different economy than one we've experienced since before World War II, since the Great Depression. Uh, and with a meltdown in the financial industry, with a meltdown in the housing industry, with in, uh, unemployment approaching 10 percent, people may attend fewer games, may maybe trade down from box seats to upper deck seats. Um, the game is too strong not to survive and survive well during an economic downturn.